Hi guys, welcome to Memories Forever. Today I'm going to show you how I print the images on the disk face for you. So basically, what I'm going to do, I'm going to open up my print to CD, and now I'm going to import the images that I want to use for this particular um, DVD. So uh, I'll capture these images in, and then when I've done that, I'll show you what else I do with it. Okay, so there I have all the images that I want to use for this particular DVD. So as the background image, I'm going to just drag this particular image onto the disk face, and I'm going to resize it to uh, make sure we get the whole image in of that background okay i want to lose that so bring this up a little bit get rid of that text a little bit yeah and then just bring this down to make sure it covers bring it up again there we are right okay so now i've got the image as a background that i want to use so now i'm going to add in another image I'm going to bring this edis x title in Again, and again, I'm going to resize this so that it fits the whole of, near enough, the whole of the, the DVD there. Bring that up a little bit. So that's that. And then now what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring in these adverts that I use for my DVDs that I'm on Google, I'm on Yale.com, on YouTube, Facebook, and the fact that I ship with UPS. So I'm just going to put these on there. Basically, I'm going to use a yellow one first. I'm just going to crop this. There we go. Crop that in. So it fits. Okay, there we go. Going to drag that into there. Again, with the Google, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to crop it. There we go. Okay, and then put that on above the yell. Make sure it's more or less the same size. Put it on the top. This is just a rough, a rough idea. It just gives you some of the idea of how it's done. Again, crop this again. The Facebook. There we go. Put that on top of there, resize it, and make that a little bit, that's it, and then again with the uh, YouTube, crop that again, there we go, and then bring that on top of there, again resize it so it fits the same as the others, this is just a rough a rough uh, go but like it gives you some idea of what what happens and how it's done so again then again we're going to crop crop this again so it fits there we go and then again put that on top of the youtube maybe we'll bring maybe it's not going to fit so i'm going to bring them all down a bit there we go bring that down bring that down Bring that down and bring that down so it fits. There we are. Okay, so I've got all my advertising logos there that I want people to see. Okay, so now I'm going to come to the text button and I'm going to type in memories. I like to use impact. I'm going to change the, the font to where's impact where are we yeah there we go impact i'm going to change the text color to blue there we go put that up there resize it a little bit there we are memories and then uh, do the number f do the number four same thing again change the text color to blue and then the font to uh, impact. 
There we go. And then resize this, make this a little bit bigger. There we are. And then type in ever. E V E R. There we go. Ever again. Impact. Do, 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 do. Where's impact? Where are where are you gone? Oh, there you are. Right, okay. There we are. And then blue. There we go. Memories forever. There we go. Put that there. Just roughly give you some idea. So there's memories forever. And then uh, put in um, uh, video transfers to DVD. I'll put in cine film as well. Video and cine. There we go. Video and cine film transfers to DVD. Again, make that blue. Uh, make that bold. Put a shadow on that as well. Make it a white shadow. There we are, and then that goes on. We'll resize that as well, make that a little bit smaller. So we make that uh, about a 12. There we go, and then give it give the DVD a title. Uh, a common one is I use is this one family cine film again. Uh, make the text color blue with a shadow on it the white shadow and then make that there you are that's it so there we go drag that down there there we are so you can see the top and then i just put my website underneath that so it's www.memories dash for dash ever dot co dot uk uh, text settings make that bold with a white text text color no no with a white shadow rather sorry there we go make that a white shadow Boom. and make that a bit smaller and make that uh, again, make that um, 14. There we go. So there you have. My web address. Now what you can do as well. If you don't want to. You can put a box. Put that text in a box. So if I come up to graphics. And I make it a rectangle. Make a rectangle. And then I can put that over the text and right click on that center back and bring it forward there we go so now I've got that text in the box and then if I want to I can change this one in the box I can change the uh, change the color of the box. So we have a line color. At the moment the line color so will have a we'll have a blue line. Uh, make it a bit thick. There we go. So there we go. Blue line thick up, and then make that text a little bit smaller. Make it. That's it. Yeah, that's fine. So just make that box a little bit bigger. And then put them text into like there, like so. So there you go, guys. I've got my text in the box, all ready to go. That's just a rough idea of how I create uh, your um, discs to be printed on and stuff like that. You can send me photos or any image you want, anything like that. Send me anything, any text you want, you can have on there as well. So there you go, guys. That's how it's done. Thanks very much.